What's good, YouTube? It's your boy Juan TV, and I am back with another video. Before we get into today's video, make sure you like this video, follow your boy on IG, make sure you follow your boy on TikTok, and make sure you most importantly subscribe to the channel. All right, y'all. So on today's video, we have the Team Red or Artisanal Red Jordan One. These did come out. I want to say the last weekend in April, like April 27th, somewhere around there. And these are still sitting, they chilling, you know what I'm saying? I was able to get mine on Nike for I think 25% off. Cause I did want this shoe, but I told myself if I couldn't get this shoe for under retail and I wasn't gonna get it. So yeah, let's go ahead and get into them. All right, so we got the box right here. This is an all over burgundy color or the team red color that they saying. Got it all over the box with the white Nike logo around the entire box. Box of Breathe Air Jordan 1 Retro High OG. Colorway is white and team red. And this is my size for the feet, you feel me? These do come with a extra set of laces. They come with that team red color of laces right there. No other extra additional laces. And then we got the shoes right here in the Air Jordan 1 in that team red or artisanal red colorway. And these is nice. Like I like these. When these first surfaced, when they shock dropped way back in like February or March, they had shock dropped like a month early. I knew I liked these. These are hard it reminds me of an og colorway or even like a collegiate type of vibe and these are nice this is a nice deep dark red it's not really quite burgundy it's like a, a bloodshot red and it just looks nice starting with the outsole you do have a standard air jordan one outsole y'all know what that looks like stars on the top ball the foot right there with the nike right there in the middle going up to the midsole they did not give us any sale on this shoe just a plain pure white which is fine with me i still think the shoe looks great without it and then up top you get that nice unc color blocking swapped out for that team red color which i think looks hella nice like this is a good shoe right here you have that team red around the toe up the eyelets around the back half of the shoe as well as on the swoosh you do have a white wings logo right there up top of the ankle you do get that white tongue tab with the team red Nike Air. And on the insole, you do get a team red insole with a white Nike Air. It do come standard lace with the white laces, and that's pretty much it on these. Like, this is a very simple, clean shoe. I ain't really gotta think too much about it. Like I said, when these first came out, I told myself if I couldn't get these under retail, I wasn't gonna get them. I was able to get these for 135 from Nike, and I'm satisfied, you know what I'm saying? Like, I can see myself pulling off some good fits with these. And the shoe just really reminds me of, I know everybody been saying it, but the Storm Blue Jordan 1 is pretty much the same exact thing. This is like a really dark version of a blue color, and they just did the same thing with the red on these. Even though this is an OG colorway, these look nice too. These, these is fire. They ain't touching Storm Blues, but they also nice. But as you look at them, they're pretty much the same shoe, just swapped out the red for the blue, or sort of the blue for the red, whatever, however you want to say it. But yeah, pretty much the same exact shoe. And for me, if you're a Jordan 1 fan, such as myself, right now is the perfect time to buy Jordan 1s. Pretty much any Jordan 1 that has came out in the past year is either at retail or going under retail. Like you have these, the Ochres, the Green Glows, um, UNC toes, even Palominos. You have all these shoes that are either under retail or are right at retail that you can get for a good price. You feel me? And you can't really beat that in my opinion. Like this is a good clean shoe right here. It's two shoes that people brought up when this shoe came out and that is the Mauve Jordan 1 and the Bordeaux Jordan 1. I actually have had the Bordeaux in hand before. This is better than both of those shoes in my opinion. Like this is not like a true Bordeaux burgundy color. Like I said, it's a team red. It's a really dark bloodshot tone of red and it looks looks nice almost like a wine type of color you know what i mean that team red i guess that white gives you that collegiate feel like i said earlier and these are just nice and i did see some people say that they got these on sale for like a hundred dollars for like 120 
You know what I'm saying? So people are buying these, but they're just pretty much doing the same thing that I said, which is just waiting until they go on discount, which is completely fine. For like everyday consumers, it's definitely a perfect time to buy. Nothing's really selling out. And if they do sell out, they're not really going for that much of a retail. So it's like, cop what you like. But yeah, that is the Air Jordan 1 and that Team Red colorway. All right, y'all, that is my thoughts and opinions about the Air Jordan 1 Team Red. Like I said earlier, if you're a Jordan 1 fan, pretty much every Jordan 1 that has released is either at retail or under. So it's a great time to buy Jordan 1s right now. They're not hype anymore, and they still produce a lot of colorways. So it's definitely some good bang for your buck with these Jordan 1s. Like me, I'm still picking up pairs. You got these. You got the wash black from last year. You also got the UNC toes from last year. There's definitely some good Jordan 1s still coming out. But since there's no hype to them, there's no resale value. And that's fine with me. I can get them for the low ski. You feel me? But yeah, y'all let me know what y'all think about this colorway. I think it's fire. It's dope. I can see a lot of people rocking off some good fits with these. It's plain, simple, dark red with the white. Can't really mess it up too much. But yeah, they fired me. Y'all let me know what y'all think. If you like this video, make sure you like, comment, subscribe, all that good shit, all that hot shit. It's your boy Juan TV on the road to 10K subscribers. And I'm gone. Yeah, it is.